Rob Wingert reporting live from the Stevens University Mustang Athletic Gala. Here joined with um, gala founder, I guess, is a fair enough title for the day. Uh, Sam Murray, welcome to the show. Oh, thank you. I wouldn't qualify me as a founder, but uh, been a big part of, I guess, helping plan the event. So. Yeah, well, you may not see yourself as the founder, but uh, an event like this does not look and go as well as this one will without a lot of time and effort put into it. So just talk about your experiences getting ready to host such a, a wonderful, monumentous occasion for our student-athletes here. Yeah, it's been um, a long few months for sure, but um, the help of Melissa Button, first of all, has kind of spearheaded this, and SAC. SAC has been... Uh, huge in planning this. I mean, all this is because of them. It's the student athletes who, who wanted the difference, who wanted the change and a little more exciting event. So um, a lot of time and a lot of effort has been put into it. It's a lot of changes, but I hope it's good changes and, and ones that people are excited for. Obviously, the Student Athlete Advisory Committee is something that is near and dear to my heart, and yep. it's great to see that the student athletes are recognizing the voice they have and the ability to make change and institute experiences on these campus. But speaking of experiences of student athletes, yep. you're presenting Moment of the Year tonight. Yep. So um, talk a little bit about some of the nominees of that award and what way you think it may be headed right now. Yes, yeah, so Moment of the Year is one of our new awards, um, along with Play of the Year, Alumni Award, and Fran Fiddler Spirit Award. So we're really excited. That's the one I'm excited for. Yeah, we're really excited about, about all four new awards. Um, Moment of the Year, we just thought is, we have so many great student athletes, so many great teams, so many great players, but so many great moments have happened. Um, and we have men's ice hockey taking the ice for the first time winning their inaugural game, football winning the MAC championship in just their sixth season. Um, we have, oh man, what else do we have? Devontae Williams, track and field, going to the NCAA tournament and finishing fourth. Sarah Tarbert, women's basketball, that double-double streak is insane. Um, you know, we have six different moments. I can't think of the other two off the top of my head right now, so apologize, but... You mentioned all these great moments. How difficult was it to whittle it down to just six with the amazing prowess and ability of all the student athletes and the programs here on campus? Was it difficult to get it down to just six? Uh, yeah, it was difficult. We had a long sheet uh, of moments and plays, and, and one of the moments that um, unfortunately didn't make it that should have, and it was kind of almost after the fact that happened, was Dan Williams' no-hitter. Um, so that's not even included in the moment of the year, and that was – one of the top moments. Yeah, we just had the chance to talk to yeah. Dan about his no-hitter and to do it on his mom's birthday as a gift to her. What a special moment. I didn't know that. That's awesome. And yeah. then he went to football practice exactly, after that. Exactly, right after. Yeah. Um, but kids like Dan, some of the other ones you've mentioned, these programs, it, it comes all circle back to the sense of community and family that exists in Stevenson Athletics. What does it mean to you to be a part of this Stevenson Athletic community for, what is it, eight years now? Yeah, over seven. So, I mean, I wouldn't I wouldn't be here if I didn't believe in it and didn't feel that sense of community and sense of family. Um, I, I, I love Stevenson, and um, I don't see myself leaving anytime soon as long as they'll have me. And um, from the, the staff that works here that I work with every day to the student athletes I work with every day, I mean, I do my job for them. Um, I want their experience to be the best experience that they have, and um, that's why I do what I do. I couldn't have said it better myself, Sam. Um, we really appreciate you taking the time to come on the show. And as an alumni and former student athlete, we appreciate all the hard work you've put in, not just for the gala, but with all your work here for the student athletes. You certainly make it a special place to compete and be a part of that family. So thank you. Well, thank you for, for coming back and helping us with our inaugural Mustang Gala. We're excited that you're here and doing this for us. As am I. Thanks, Sam. All right. Rob Wingert reporting live from the Stevens University Mustang Athletic Gala.